हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू नेक्स्ट वीडियो ऑफ स्क्रैच इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू क्रिएट अ बेसिक प्रोग्राम ऑफ स्क्रैच विच इज कॉल्ड पार्टी एनिमल्स वी आर गोइंग टू डू यू नो एड सम न्यू स्प्राइट्स एंड एड इवेंट्स टू दैम एंड मेक दम डू सम डांस स्टेप्स सो दिस इज वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इन टूडेज प्रोग्राम so i'm going to choose one more sprite let's say this is goga okay so now i'm going to choose another background from here choose a backdrop okay it's on the corner of right hand side now let's just choose this party background mm it's a concert okay we have this okay this looks like a party now we want our sprite to dance okay so whenever green flag is clicked so i'm going to go into events its name is gobo i said goga but it's gobo okay now when green flag is clicked i want my cat sprite to dance okay and i want him him to dance continuously so that is why i am going to control block and using in forever loop this is called forever loop now what i want sprite to do i want him to move 10 steps and i'm making it minus 10 because i want him to move 10 steps backward forward plus backward minus and in between moving forward and moving backward i want him to wait for some time so wait comes under control block now we have this wait i'm going to drag this and drop it between moment okay i'm going to reduce this to 0.5 second Now let's see what happens. Okay, so cat sprite is dancing. Now, now I want my sprite to change its costume also. Costume by costume, I mean its poses. Okay, so in looks, I'll go and I'll choose switch costume to. Switch costume to costume two, okay. And now, after moving backwards, switch costume to costume one, okay. Now let's see what happens. It's looking a bit awkward. I will change this. Okay, first costume one and then costume two. Now see let's how it looks. Okay now it's looking like a proper dance. Okay. When I change the wait time, you can see how it is moving. It's moving a bit fast, right? Okay. Now let's just make the wait to 0.3 seconds. And now it looks like more proper. Okay. Now for Gogo, let's just place him somewhere in the dance floor, on the dance floor, and let's plan even for him. Okay, then click again forever loop. Gogo also wants to dance, right? Now move ten steps. 
forward and then wait for Again, move ten, minus 10 steps forward and backward. Which costume? We can choose from the drag down list what costumes we want for Gobo. Okay. This is Sprite 1 and this is Sprite 2. Now it looks like a proper dance. Okay. Let's add more animal to it. One more sprite and now I'm going to choose a dinosaur I think. This dinosaur 4 is looking amazing. Yes. So I'm going to place a dinosaur here and same events will be copied from Gobo or Sprite 1 to dinosaur and they all will dance. And they all will dance. Just change the costumes. And play it. Okay, so our dinosaur is dancing. It looks amazing, right? <laughs> we can change the dinosaur costumes. It has open mouth costume also. If I increase the wait time, we can see the costumes clearly. See? It's opening its mouth. See, Nick, na? Amazing. Okay, now let's see it as full screen. So when I click the green flag, all of them are dancing. So this is it for this video. I hope you like it. Scratch programming is very simple. I, sh I must say everyone should try it. If you like the video, do hit the like button and bye for now. I will meet you in the next video.